Welcome to our YouTube channel. My name is Asmi. And I'm Roger. And, and welcome, welcome to Roger and Asmi Vlogs. So for today's subject, Filipinas' behavior, which is married to a foreigner. Yes. Okay. Dagang salamat sa yung suporta o paghigugma sa among channel. Thank you so much, guys, for your support and love. And if you're new to this channel, don't forget to click like, share, and subscribe. And hit the notification bell for new uploads or new videos. Oh, yes. Yeah. So, we actually choose this topic today because one of our subscriber comments, right? about this yeah not just a comment but directly uh message or contact us mm. personally uh, yeah personally and thank you so much if you're watching this uh video so well yeah this is our observation also which is really common yeah very common indeed so his um, comment is, I think you guys should do a vlog on what happens when you bring your wife or fiancé or Gia to the West. My kaibigan and I bought, brought our wives to the U.S. and they become westernized. And both our relationship ended within five years. Sad to say. Sad to say. But, you know, I would, I would say that not all. Again, guys, not all Filipinas would change if they would go to the U.S. Not all of them, but some of them. Again, guys, some of them. We're not, we're not just pointing out those that married to a foreigner. Um, also, Filipinas that went abroad. Yes, or Filipinos went abroad or... Their life is, uh, there's a change like uh, from poor and they drastically change like uh, they became rich rich or their their status in life is uh, what way different call, than yeah. before. What we call that they're already stable. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes. So those Filipinas that change some again guys some filipinas they forget where they came from so they forget that they were poor they forget that they eat they eat like only like two times in a day because they don't have money they forget those like experience way back before because of money yeah they they change their uh, behavior from humble to boastful. Behavior. Yeah, being boastful, they bluff, they brag, they they actually show that oh, I have money, I have something to really brag about, and this is most also people think that's not your money, that's your husband's money. Yeah, especially if they're married to a foreigner. People would think, well, in, you have this status right now because of your husband, um, because your husband, you know, has the money or a foreigner. That's why um, you 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 change, right? Yeah, because some of them don't really like say hi anymore. They don't greet the people that they were friends before when they were poor. Yeah, and they will choose who to like socialize. socialize yes and uh i can really see some filipinas here in the philippines or uh all throughout all throughout for sure uh, yeah. there are some filipinas not only here in in our place but um this kind of behavior is common in the philippines because for sure you think that all filipinos are really humble hospitable but you do not know the the downside or uh, the other side because there are some Filipinos or Filipinas that who is married to a foreigner they will change their behavior 
Yeah, I would say not like it's the same as flipping a coin. There is the other side and also the the other side too of the coin. So I would say not only Filipinas that married to a foreigner would change, but also Filipinas that would go abroad, especially if they can already earn money as much as they have when they were here in the Philippines working. They would already try to brag about what they earn, um, what their social status is right now. And, well, in fact, yeah, here in the Philippines, the salary is really small. But you don't actually try to step on another person because his salary is low. Correct. And uh, that kind of behavior, well, we cannot dictate them that, oh, hey, you have to go back or you have to look back where it came from. We cannot really dictate that because... Um, <laughs> That would be his or her behavior, right? Yeah, that's already his decision. He's already old. <laughs> or she's already old. She's already old, yeah. Well, yeah. And the other thing also is that when you uh, became rich or the, 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 the status of your life will change, you have to make sure that you have to look back or to look those person also who help you yeah you really need to look back again guys you need to look back because if you don't look back chances are you will forget and you would be lost you would really be lost instead of like be shined by money you really need to try to be humble next guys is high status so high status since they already have the money they think that they um they think that they're already rich some filipinas would not um talk to the people that are poor or they think that they are they have they don't have the similar status in life right exactly and well it's uh common here in the philippines that kind of behavior which in fact um, they came from that kind of status in life yeah. just that uh, they became high right now or she has the money because uh, you guys also have um, money and your money here in the philippines like we always said it's way different the value is different and people would think that you are rich but sad to say not all foreigners are rich yeah again it's just that the the value of your money here is bigger so that's the reason why you can afford buying uh buying for your filipina house a lot um everything Yes, your money, the value of your money is way bigger. Yes. So, and go ahead. Also, going back to um, Filipinas, like, whom they went to um, the West together with uh, their partner, and uh, for how many years they or she changed her behavior, well, maybe because... Filipinas can easily adopt what's in that country environment their environment yes so Filipinas can easily adopt about the surroundings the environment so if you would let your Filipina hang out with alpha females westernized females that you don't like so, of course, she would adopt their personality. Yeah, but once again, not all Filipinas are like that. There are some Filipinas, they know where they came from. Yeah. And without you, your partner, she's not in the West. Yes. So, not all, guys. Some. 
some, they would not forget uh, where they came from. They would not forget that they were poor. They would always think that this, this is not my money. This is your money. So I would need to be humble. I need to put my foot on the ground because without you guys, they cannot reach to the point or that level of being like stable financially stable true and um they should think or she should think that um money is not there like all the time you should be or she should always think that being a good person or being a humble person will be in mind all the time especially to your friends right true so maybe they are just you know uh we can say it sometimes that money is um a bad influence to the people yeah again the bible always say money is the root of all evil correct so i think guys uh that's all and my advice or our advice is if you notice that your filipina changed her behavior try to um cut try to cut her like horn <laughs> <laughs> try to i think try to ask what roger is saying <laughs> is uh just ask her what happened to you i think your behavior suddenly changed so yeah try to stop her while her horns is still growing <laughs> yes that's what i'm trying to say and guys um thank you so much for watching till the end and see you in our next video. Bye! Bye.